Casey Gray here from The Conscious Builder and I'm back to answer more questions. And the question I have in front of me right now is by Adrian Cougar. And the question is, what problems have you encountered using cost plus pricing and how have you handled them? Really the, the, the biggest problem we've come across is really around things that take longer than anticipated. Because we still do estimates for things. And if things take longer than anticipated and we don't let the homeowner know that it's going to take longer, that's where the problem comes into play is when they receive the invoice. So usually when we dig down to the root of this problem, the problem, which has happened a few times, has really been the communication between what's happening on site, the office, and the homeowner. So sometimes the guys on site just want to keep moving forward, and that's their job. We want them to move forward as quickly as possible, but then the communication doesn't get put back to the client or to the office, so the office can't uh, update the clients or vice versa, or maybe there's something t spoken verbally and the client forgets it, so it wasn't uh, addressed in in writing, right? So what do you do when they get the invoice and they say that they weren't told about it, then it's a he said, she said thing, and obviously we're not gonna get into those arguments with clients. Um, so what we've done to prevent those now is we've obviously improved our communication between the site and the office, and we've added processes to make sure that we have things in writing when they're going to take longer, or they're, or uh, we've un uncovered something that we were not anticipating, which happens a lot in renovations, right? Like doing a renovation or building a house is not a vacation. There's gonna be lots of surprises and not necessarily the good surprises that we like, right? So it's really about communication and keeping those lines of communication open uh, weekly meetings is something that we're that we're doing with, with all of our projects now. Uh, well, whenever necessary, not necessarily uh, required for every single project, but let's say regular meetings, and and you can adjust that for your projects. Um, so really, it's about preventative maintenance, <laughs> really, when it comes down to it. And when we have made these mistakes, and and if there are mistakes, we've owned them, right? So we've had to cover costs. We've we've had to eat some of them. And it's usually a, a back and forth, right? It's not all of our fault or all of the client's fault or or whatever. It's, it's once again, you communicate, all right, we understand your point of view. Uh, here's our side, you know, what do you think about this? And, and it's, it's about working together to come to a solution that works for everybody. Um, at the end of the day, it's never anything that's going to make or break us, but the biggest thing that we're working towards is, is just that good relationship with the homeowners, with the clients, and keeping the projects moving forward getting them done and getting out and moving on to the next project. There's no real benefit to us dragging on a project. And that's a, that's a fear that clients have. And really, there we want to get in and get out as soon as possible because the longer a project takes for us, the, the more it costs us, right? There's a cost to us being on a project if we're not able to bill or we're not getting things done. Um, so that that's one thing that I talk to clients about as well. And Sean, who's, who's doing our... Uh, uh, customer care now he he has a lot of those conversations but ultimately it comes down to communication and making sure that everybody is on the same page and putting in those systems and processes that work for you and your business and your clients glad you tuned in for another q a session if you haven't already please check out the other sessions we have done and if you have questions please post them we love receiving them i love answering them and if you have the question somebody out somebody else out there has it as well so please post it and we will catch you on the next video.